we told you we were bringing you to the beach and we are here it's a little bit still out of season I think the beaches only start getting quite well it's very busy but I mean you know like people swimming probably from end of May onwards but I wanted to show you all the cute cabanas we're just doing a walk along here these in summer like where we are here people like rent this space on the beach so it's the Lido where they get their deck chairs and their umbrellas and these are their little changing rooms the ocean is beautiful color okay so Louise told you about these little cabanas these little changing rooms this is what they look like inside this one's missing its door so it's just a little tiny room where you can get changed and you know get ready for the beach but there's a funny story I got a funny story about this when I was a student I used to look after a little boy teach him English and he, he had a before me he had an uh, au pair that used to look after him it was a, it was a young lady and <laughs> apparently he scared the hell out of her because he managed to crawl underneath these slats here well not here but wherever they were on the beach somewhere and while she was changing he was looking up and while she's changing she looks down and she just sees these two little eyes with this big grin on his face i thought it was the funniest thing anyways that's a little little gem of a story <laughs> lunch before we leave I'm very impressed we found this place like right on the ocean and I got a sandwich because I didn't have enough time to decide what I actually really wanted and the guy was staring at me but it looks pretty good look how good yeah, what did you get? Sandwich. I got a sandwich too. but it's got it's in focaccia it's got a, a sandwich cotaleta. With, and it's got like a cotaleta with a focaccia what do you got Gary? I got the same thing as Pierre the man has salad and sauce and stuff like that inside. Mm -hmm. Nice. Bali? Bali got like a club sandwich but with fish on it. Mm. Yeah. Ah, so look at mine, guys. <gasps> oh, yeah. I want to eat yours. Mm. These little fishies. Hey, don't touch, don't touch. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
we think we have a little bit of a medical emergency. <laughs> Pierre, part of Pierre's plan A, B and C was to play outside with Bali. And they were busy playing, what is it, soccer, Pierre? Yes, yeah, soccer. Soccer, uh, football. And, oh my goodness, his finger, he came in and I can't, you can't see it clearly on the camera. But it's pretty much swelled up, double the size, and it is now going purple. So we're at the hospital with Pia, and we are waiting to see a doctor. This is... Admission bracelet. Are you nervous? No. No? Okay. So we'll tell you how it goes. Pia, what happened? I put a splint on me. This thing. Oh. So we're at the hospital and Pierre has broken his finger. Yep. He's had it like bandaged up, but we have to go to see the orthopedic surgeon oh. as soon as possible. This is the hospital that he was at. But he was very brave because he stayed with the broken finger for quite a while and didn't complain about the pain. How does it feel? Yes. Show us a splint. Cool. cool. Super brave. Now, but I can, now I can smack Gabby. Something. They told you not to hurt your siblings with that.